G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today is another episode of Starting From Scratch. Well, American Truck Simulator Starting From Scratch. Now today, we're actually hauling a pressure tank 19 tonnes and we're going from Bakersfield all the way down to LA. Now, uh, we're still only earning a little bits, you know, little bits of money here. We're not earning anything really exciting at this point in time. So, um, I think I've gone and stuffed up. I should have gone and done long haul. But never mind. This is all part of learning what's what and how, what works good, that sort of thing with the game. So, uh, let's get this show on the road. Now, we're driving the Kenworth W900. This is not mine. I am still only in um, quick jobs. But that's a part of starting from scratch. Now, uh, what is the time? It's 7.35pm. We need to take a photo quickly. So let's jump out and take that photo because otherwise it's going to be too dark. Get over the fence. Over the fence. Jump the fence. Whee! Jump on the fence. And there we go. That is an, that's okay shot. It's not the best shot, but anyway, it's okay. And we'll, uh, there we go. That makes it a lot nicer with the saturation in there. And a little bit of red, too much red. And a little bit of yellow to even that out. And there we go. Turn that around. Because we can. And we'll add the field of view in there. And it gives a bit more depth in there and sort of adds to color as well, which makes it look really cool. There we go. Back on the road. Okay, now, um, you guys have actually requested for me to show you all my mods that I'm actually putting into the game now. Uh, I'm going to be listing all of my mods down below that I'm actually using so whenever I add in a mod I'll list it down below okay so you'll be able to easily see what mods I'm using and that way if you want to add them in yourself you'll be able to alright so I think at the moment it doesn't sound like we're even using the uh, W900. Is that got it in there? No, it hasn't. So we've got no mods activated. I'll have to uh, get some mods activated in here, guys, and see what we can put in. Uh, some of the trucks in here uh, probably be the W900. I'm going to leave the way it is. This one, and I might put uh, I don't know the Argosy in maybe. See how we go. But if you've got any suggestions that you'd like for mods, then feel free to put them in the comments below. I'm always up for suggestions. And you stay there, bus. Don't you go pulling out. And here we go. Around the corner, onto the freeway or the highway, whatever you want to call it. Wherever you're from, you'll call it something different, I'm sure. And I'm just gonna make I like making my own run off ramp run up ramp. Off ramp. So that way uh, we can get on there quicker because they're way too short, I think, these ramps. Now, these night trips are I, I really don't like the night trips as much as the day trips. I really like to see the scenery. We're driving along without the um, being able to see the scenery. Can be a little bit sort of yeah, but anyway. Now the uh, there is some updates that are coming very soon. They're probably that well the beta is out from the time that I'm recording this. The beta is out, which I'll be trying very soon, guys, and showing you some clips. Might even do some drives, that sort of thing. Uh, we'll show you what actually, what you can do with the wheels and that sort of thing. So, 
Um, that'll be something I'll be getting into soon. Which is really cool. We'll have a look at that. Uh, what's what you can actually do with the beta. And um, yeah, so that should be a lot of fun. Uh, I've seen that there's like wheels that you can change. There's like a whole heap of stuff. Um, what else? What? Let's see. So you got Steam Workshop. That's a big one. I can't wait to test that out. The Steam Workshop, and need to put that on cruise control. Uh, then we've got the the wheels, the rims, new rims. So you got the nuts and you know the inserts and that sort of thing. Um, I have heard by a little bird that um, it's not as uh, American Truck Simulator version of, of it of the wheels and that is not as good as the Euro Truck version so that's a bit of a shame I'll, I'll check that out and we'll uh, have a look at that uh, the, yeah navica navigation path will be disabled so that'll be cool if you don't like that you can always take it out route advisor can be hidden and so yeah, that's uh, that's it. Oh, geez, I'm going off the road here. Need to get back on the road. Need to stop reading that paper, and I need to start watching what I'm doing. That's what I need to do. All right, so it's dark. Yeah, I don't really like the dark so much. Much rather it during the day. But I'm glad I took those photos when I did because look at it now. Be terrible taking a photo now. But um, yeah, this week has been an interesting week. This week, it's always interesting for me. I'm back at work now, so uh, I'm all recovered. Uh, pretty good. I'm sort of easing back into it, taking it easy. So uh, not pushing myself too hard. And let's see, we're going to go around this corner here. Oops. There we go. I had it in the right gear I wanted anyway. Five low. And around we go. I think all my mods have gone out. Why have my mods gone out? That is weird. Pretty sure I added some mods. Never mind, I'll have a look at that for next time. Oh, I know what it was. I was playing around with it on multiplayer uh, and I had to take the mods out. That's what it was. Dope. I forgot. I wasn't actually driving in multiplayer. I was just trying to... I logged in through this account with multiplayer and it would have taken out the mods. There we go. So this, the convoys that we've actually doing are pretty good. I was going to say this weekend, which reminds me, I haven't even set up the convoy for the weekend anyway. But by the time you see this video, the convoy will be over anyway. So it's all pre-recorded, this stuff. We're nearly at the destination already. Wow, this is going to be a quick video. No, surely it can't be that close. Nothing coming. We're just going to zip around really quick. Come on, truck. You can get in there. Is it? We almost at our destination already. We are too. Look at that. Not too far away. Wow, wasn't that far? I thought, you know, thought it might have been a bit longer, but obviously not. Never mind, only a little quick one, quick little drive. It's all good. Once we get these uh, longer loads in, I'll have to pop in some longer, longer hauls. That's where the money was in Euro trucks, in longer hauls. 
And once we get up some money, some decent money, like, uh, we get up about a uh, hundred grand, we're going to buy it, we're going to uh, take a loan out. And then we're going to buy a, we'll get, not a hundred grand, sorry, a hundred and twenty grand. We'll buy a truck and then we'll take a loan out and we will buy another truck, uh, sorry, the warehouse, another truck and see what, where we can go from there. Maybe we might be able to buy another truck and get another employee driving it. We'll see. But every dollar counts for, uh, you know, getting this game a rolling. That'll be right. Just as you're slowing down, the light changes. I've not seen any strip clubs in this game. It's not like Grand Theft Auto, I suppose. In Grand Theft Auto, you see strip clubs everywhere. Right, red light, red light. Okay. Chuck that into too low. Ooh, this seems to be struggling. Must have a low horsepower engine. Come on, you can do it. Oh, it's getting there. <laughs> There we go. Uh, 48 through here, senior. So knock that down. Don't want to get a fine because that's money we lose. Alright, and... There we go. There is our destination. Just turn in here. It's gone up to 89 now, but we're still doing 45. That's all right. We're turning anyway. Now we can turn on right. That's oh, green anyway. Turn on red, sorry. Turn right on red. You can do that here in Australia too. Turn left on red, but only in some places. Not all places will allow you to do that. So you have to be careful if you come to Australia, you can't just turn on left. The cops will not be happy. Eh, fuel station, we don't need any fuel. So um, lately we've been playing a bit of Farming Simulator 15. They seem to have worked out all the bugs, which is really cool. Hopefully they keep the same sort of setup for Farming Simulator 17 so they don't have so many sort of problems. Because when 15 came out for the very first time, oh man was I upset. I was very cranky because the game was very very buggy. It was worse than a Microsoft operating system and that's saying something. Right, we would like to go there, thank you. And uh, we've also got our own server now, so uh, if you have like to join the server, then uh, let me know and we'll uh, get you that information. So, uh, have a lot of fun there. We can have up to 10 people at a time, so, you know, that's a few people. If we need more, we'll have to look at getting more in the future, but for now, that's fine. We'll stick with 10. Right, there we go, and let's back this up into that nice little spot there. Alright, is it going to go, is it going in there nicely? Looks like it.
I gotta keep the back of the trailer in the mirror so I can see. Now, just going to. Uh, can't see out there. I have to just jump out and see if we're going. No, we're way off. Way off. Way off. Okay, try that again and try not to bump it too much. See if I can turn it and I'm gonna get past that trailer. No, I'm not. I'm not going to. Seniors bad backing up attempts. Episode one. <laughs> Not the best at backing up, guys, but I get it done. It's the main thing. Gee whiz, that is terrible. Whoops, wrong way. I need to go this way. And now I just need to, now it's in the hole, I need to straighten it up. Oh, watch out for the gasoline over there. <laughs> that would be a catastrophe. Right, now that it's straight, I should be able to jump in here and back it in properly. Oops, put it in reverse might help. use the mirrors and is that gonna let me have that that's no, gone all cockeyed okay straight in that should go straight in and should not be a problem And is that going to give it to me? There we go. That's given it to me. Thank you very much. Drop it off. And there we go. That is awesome. Right. So take a photo of that for the VTC. Virtual Trucking Company. And uh, there we go. That is done. And that's an excellent... That's awesome. That's just what we need. Well, guys, that is pretty much it for this episode. Don't forget to tune in for some more... Uh, so sorry, some more American Truck Simulator uh, starting from scratch very soon. We'll uh, have some more episodes coming out. Also, there's Bus Simulator 16 where we started off with that as well. So uh, that's really interesting uh, as well. Don't forget about the uh, sneak peeks. Uh, the, sorry, not sneak peeks. They're not sneak peeks now. They're mod reviews for some of the mods that we have been looking at as well. But that is pretty much it for me, guys. Look, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to uh, keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down, and I'm 1010 on the side. And remember, game on!